Live pictures tonight from the entrance of Butler High School in Matthews. In just a few hours, students, teachers and staff will return to Butler High days after a deadly school shooting. It will be a very emotional day for hundreds of students. Many parents are still worried about their children's safety. Charlotte Mecklenburg Schools telling us tonight counselors will be on hand. There will be extra staff, security and law enforcement at the school as well. NBC Charlotte's Rachel Brown joins us live from the campus in Matthews and Rachel, the school is really hoping to make students feel at ease and safe when they go back to school. Sarah, that's exactly right. The community knows it will take weeks, even months to heal. So when students go into those doors tomorrow, they want them to feel supported and most importantly, feel safe. What happened Monday can't be undone. 16 year old sophomore Bobby McKeithen was shot and killed when police say his classmate Jutuan Craig Cuffey pulled out a gun as the two fought in the hallway. It was a situation that should have never happened. Um, a child shouldn't have been able to walk in with a gun and be able to shoot my baby in his, just shoot him in his side and kill him. But it did happen. And now Butler High School is working to help students heal as they fight through the pain. According to the school's website, crisis counselors will be on hand from 9 to 1 in the afternoon and there again on Friday. Students will also notice an increased police presence. The Matthews Police Chief plans to welcome students at the door. And once inside, students should expect assemblies all morning. The principal says he wants to speak with them directly. I think whether you knew him or not, you're, you're still hurting. Um, he was part of the community, he was part of our school. No immediate changes to security have been announced, but CMS Superintendent Dr. Clayton Wilcox says metal detectors and other procedures are being discussed once again. We'll probably also look at wands and we'll look at random searches of kids. We'll look at perhaps uh, the idea around only saying that you can use a clear backpack. And we know that midterm exams have been rescheduled. The school officials say their main priority right now is meeting students' social and emotional needs. I'm live outside Butler High School in Matthews. Rachel Brown, NBC Charlotte. Rachel, thank you. And we'll continue to follow this story as the investigation progresses. You can always find the latest inside the NBC Charlotte mobile app and on our website, wcnc.com.